It's back to school time, or should I say back to homeschool time. Today I'm going to show you how to make a DIY homeschool desk that is big enough for three people. Let's do this. First thing you need to do is find two old filing cabinets that are the same height. We found ours at the thrift store. I decided to paint the filing cabinets because they're a little grody. Let's tape up the hardware. That's what it's called, hardware. Now that the hardware is all taped up, we're going to get some sandpaper and sand it down so that the paint will stick better. Now comes the fun part. I have three different shades of green here. One of them is leafy green, mossy green, and machine green. You guys gotta help me decide which one we're gonna use on these filing cabinets, because as you know, I'm a very indecisive person. This one is called leafy green. Moss green. Machine green. What do you guys think? Tell me in the comments down below. Which one should I use? Number one, number two, or number three? This one is like happy, and this one is more like subtle, and then this one is like a, it has like a yellow in it. I just don't know which one to choose. It's, it's, it's... <laughs> so before we commit to a color, let's make the top of the desk first. So next we bought five 10 foot boards, and these boards are six inches by two inches. I'm just going to lime, lime. I'm just going to line them up. Perfect. I'm going to measure the top of the filing cabinet so it fits perfectly underneath the desk. And now we're going to mark that distance on both ends of the board. This board right here is going to hold all of the bigger boards together. I have one on the other side too. Oh, it's on doing? the shoe! Grab your sandal and squish it. Guys, we have a problem. Ah! There's a spider. I'm not afraid of spiders. <laughs> People are gonna hate on us for killing it. <laughs> Sorry, spider lovers. It's time for him to leave this earth. He's in the work zone. I don't want to kill him. I feel bad. I can just... <laughs> yeah, flip him. Flip him in the ground. Wait, but what if he goes like that and lands on me? That'll be great YouTube. <laughs> Comment, like, subscribe. <laughs> it's not even. No. Uh -huh. Oh, you got it. Okay, back to your regular scheduled programming. <laughs> All right. See, so the cabinet's gonna fit right here. Super All right. Snug. Like a hug. Like a hug. I'm going to use these bolts to attach both of these boards together. So we're going to drill holes in the middle of each board so that we can put them in and they'll stay in. Power tools! Don't worry, I have adult supervision. Now I'm just going to tighten this on the other side. Okay, now we're gonna get this tool, this thingy, and put that right there. Come on, just, just work with me. And this one right there. Okay. Yes! We have built a table! Now we're going to stain it. We're going to put the wood conditioner on first and then the stain. It's kind of like shampoo and conditioner, but in reverse. Time for the stain. I'm just using old socks to spread it. It looks like tar. It does. Tar on a sock. Now it's time to paint. Guys, I think I actually decided on a color. We're going with the middle one. Moss green.
graffiti. So it's gonna take a couple coats, but we'll eventually make it look good. I decided to put some inspiring words in the label slots on the filing cabinets. Growth mindset is a big thing with my school and family. What words would you put in there to inspire yourself throughout the school year? Comment down below. Get ready for some close-ups. I'm so excited to use this homeschool workstation. If I can do this DIY homeschool desk, then you can do it. Well, there you have it. You have no excuses now. You have to work on your schoolwork. At least you have a comfortable place to do it. And your siblings can join you too. Okay, coming up, I'm super excited for the next video because I will be decorating and adding more things to the desk. To make it more interesting don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you know when we upload videos so you know when we upload new videos and until we meet again don't forget to check out my latest video a face mask video i tested out multiple different types of face masks with my mom and brother see you guys next time and don't forget keep your sunny side up